Ah, uh, hello. I was wondering if I could speak to the manager for Oaks Hotels and Resorts. Sure, it's about a complaint. Yeah, well, I really wanted to convey this to the to the big wig who's got the uh, expensive car and uh, who gets the big salary, just to tell him what a horrible stay I had at one of your recent recent resorts. Mm. Sure. Sure. Well, I, I've stayed at the Oaks Oasis Resort since it was a Ridges Resort in the early noughties. Okay? Now, I understand the Oaks Oasis is a Bogan Hotel. I understand your your socio-demographic is working class tradies. However, let me just say this to you, you know, we turn up, day one, we have a fire evacuation at 4.30 in the morning. Day two, and, I, and, and the honest answer is, even the night of the fire evacuation, our aircon wasn't really working. And it's failed to work ever since. And I mean, I was so cheesed off with you guys there. I went to the reception and I asked for my money back. I asked for my money back and said to them, this is an awful holiday. We get woken up at 4.30 in the morning for day one and ever since then the aircon hasn't worked. And everyone's so blasé, oh, we're working on it, yeah, we're working on it. Well, you know, it just ain't good enough. It's the middle of summer, you've got the windows bolted shut to stop Bogan stealing TVs and furniture, which is fair enough, I understand. But Jesus Christ, it's like a sauna in the hotel rooms. No, I've checked out. I checked out and, and I, I just wanted to talk to the CEO with the fancy European car just to tell him how much it sucked. I'm just saying, just disappointed, so disappointed it's not funny. I mean, your staff there, all they do is hand out water. It's pathetic. And I can tell you this now, you know, it's only when, you know, everyone pretends to be nice. Well, I'm pissed off. I'm angry, right? And and, and I, 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 I think it's perfectly, you know, I, I think it's, I, I want to, you know, you guys, you know, just so blasé about it. It's just ridiculous. And you wrecked my holiday. I haven't slept in two days. And I'm just saying, you know, I'm just disappointed. The whole thing is a struggle. To get a refund, it's a fight. You guys should be ashamed of yourself. You're running a resort and a hotel, even though it's a Bogan resort and a Bogan hotel. You damn well have got to do a better job than this. Do you do maintenance on your air conditioning? Do you do any sort of maintenance? This is ridiculous. You've got no fallback, no backup plans. This is a disgrace. You people should be ashamed of the place you're running. And I want to talk to the guy who drives the fancy European car and tell him. I don't know why I need to talk to his secretary or his liaison officer when he needs to hear it himself. Isn't he man enough to take my call? I want to whinge to him and tell him how pissed off I am. It's not about money. It's about whinging to him and giving him, making sure he has a really shitty day. Sure. Yeah, well, you get him to ring me. I want to whinge to him when he's free. Sure. Well, I'll give you my phone number, okay? 0421. Paul Pluto. And I've stayed at your resort about 30 times. I've stayed at the Calypso, I've stayed at the, the Oasis, and I'm just disappointed. Your, the way you handle things is poor, very poor. There's people there who, who, who don't have the balls like me to complain, but they're angry. You need to sort this stuff out. You should be ashamed of yourself for running a hotel and resort like this. It's pretty crap. Yeah, yeah. Well, 
pass it on to him, tell him to ring me up and I'll tell him to his face how crap the place is. Because he needs to hear some home truths. That's what he needs to hear. He needs to hear the reality. And, 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 and what you guys are doing there is a joke. You shouldn't be in business if that's how you run the joint.